and welcome to see the stories we're finally here in the final hour and we have luxury artisan and painter famed for his works on art and bags wallets and other handicrafts leka putra right here with us hi mas leka hi. thank you so much for coming hi. to our studio this afternoon thank you for having me well this certainly looks amazing uh -huh. um first things first can you tell us how you got into luxury uh, how to you became a luxury painter okay so um i have always loved painting and drawing mm -hmm. since i was since as far as i can remember mm -hmm. <laughs> but it was just started as a hobby and then it started to become like a side hustle and then the side hustle becoming more main and more a yeah, <laughs> main job and then uh, i decided to do that a full-time job and then at some point Louis Vuitton Indonesia asked me to be their first Indonesian painter, in-house wow. painter. So yeah, that's 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 when I started to be like focusing on 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 luxury items. Okay, so everything that you when you were with Louis Vuitton, was it like your own creation, or did they have like directives on what type of themes you need to have? Um, they do have certain standards mm. and limitations, uh, if I can say. But uh, it's also requested by the clients. I see. Yeah. Okay. Ah. So now, um, suppose that we are our clients, <laughs> your clients. Can yes, you sir. teach us how to paint though? Of course, of course. I think we have all that no. we need. Uh, first things first, yeah. can, can we see some of your work? Yes. Because yes. you brought some of your work and yes. that looks very amazing. This. Wow. Thank you so much. Yeah, these are this some is... of the paintings. So cute wow. and artsy. I would love to have wow, this. Wow, this is um, so nice. Yes. So this is, I, I'm, I'm holding an uh, LV leather right This here. is like yeah. so realistic. <laughs> okay. Right? Yeah. Look at how beautiful this is. Uh, I know, Kai, you have a Hermes bag at home, right? I maybe wish. Maybe if you want to go and dreams, if I work really, really hard, maybe someday I will. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, maybe after we have the painting lesson today, Kai will, will paint on her Hermes bag. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I okay. wish. But uh, Maslaika, while yeah. we're discussing this, um, can you can you show us how to paint on leather? Is there of a course. specific technique? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have all the things we need here. Um, yep. We <coughs> need the paint, obviously, mm -hmm. and the brush. Um, mm -hmm. I'm just gonna stand. Wow, this is a very expensive painting lesson because <laughs> I really the like materials this. are also very expensive. Um, very cute. This is the brush I use. Probably one of the smallest brush. Smallest. And is, do you have any specific reason why we have to? It's use the small? size of ten per zero. Uh -huh. wow. So it's not zero. It's like ten per ten. zero. Yeah. Um, it it helped me to create the details. The mm -hmm. details. Yeah. So so I need to do it uh, with the smallest uh, brush. And then here's the pouch. So we're going oh. to paint. Oh. What color do you want? Mm, I think oh. I'm going stealth color. For... The matching one with your top? Oh, that one. I'm going for yellow. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll have the matchy, matchy one. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, so we have the paint, the brush, and then water mm -hmm. okay. to, you know, uh, soften the brush. Yeah. Mm -hmm. First of all, we are going to dip the brush yes. on the water just to make sure that it's going to be soft. Mm -hmm. We have to keep it soft. And then we have this palette of colors here. Mm -hmm. So what kind of paint are we using here? Um, it's almost like acrylic paint, mm -hmm. but it's with uh, a special mix because acrylic is used for the canvas, right? Yeah. So it's not it's not very flexible. Mm -hmm. But if you want to paint on the backs, then you should like have that. like more elastic formula. Oh. So, ah. Yeah, it's, it's a, a very specific paint. What is it called? Um, is actually acrylic base, but for leather uh, and fabric paint. <laughs> right. Leather and fabric paint. Yes. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so uh, these are a few samples if you so, need. All right. Okay, I'm gonna get this one. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Ooh, yes. Um, hmm. If you are not sure, you can use this white gel pen to sketch. Okay. But if you are feeling like it's no, super like easy, then <laughs> like yeah, yeah. you can just directly paint uh, All right. on the pouch. On, on, on the um, pouch. Okay. okay, so we have the brush softened. Mm -hmm. And you also want to make sure that the brush is dry. Oh, okay, so we, we dry it after we yeah. 
make it wet, right? Okay. And then I am suggesting you start it with the most, the smallest part of the design. The smallest part of the design. Yeah, yeah. Let's say maybe the branch. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So on this case, in this case, I should start with the white or with the uh, green? Um, I'm going to suggest to start with the green. With the green? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. So I'm, I'm going to be the one experimenting with the sketch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so... Okay. What so, I'm going to do now, I'm just going to just use the tip of the brush because we want to do a very thin lines. You know, I have this theory mm -hmm. of painting. I usually tell my viewers or people I teach painting, I usually tell them that my secret of painting is small brush mm -hmm. and hold your breath. Small oh. brush and hold your breath. Yeah. I'm holding my breath. I'm holding my breath. <laughs> I'm, I'm holding, holding my, my breath. breath. Still, I'm not breathing. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. Let's try it. So, oh, that's it. Hmm? what inspired you to pursue a career in luxury art in the, in the first place? Um, to be totally honest with you, it's it's not really a pursue. It's really? just something. It's just something that I cannot escape. Oh. I mean, it's it's going to be a bit personal, but coming from coming from a family that's not really familiar with with an art as a professional, mm -hmm. I always choose what is the most familiar, what is what is the uh, what is the job that that feels secure at that time. So yeah, I, I started working as as an office worker, but then I, I have always loved painting. Yeah. And I keep on thinking what could I be? Wow. So yeah, and then and then I found it. So it's it's never really like I really want to do this. It's just it's just something I try to like not doing. It's sort of like a nice it's, uh, sort of like a trap to you, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I ended up coming. It's just mm. the way people know me is is like a who loves painting. Mm. It's always been like that. It's always been like that. Yeah. So how many brands have you worked together with, or oh, is there any specific after the Louis Vuitton? And then do you have any other brands? Um, the other brands are are the occasional mm -hmm. usually so this will be the permission to drop the name brands yeah <laughs> <laughs> so um i have worked with dior dior mm. um what else uh prada <coughs> and max mara and a few luxury cosmetic brands all right so yeah, like on SK2. cosmetic brands you painted on the products um they usually have the <coughs> souvenirs for for the ah, okay. uh, guest yeah yeah oh, so, so it's like a corporate workshop yeah corporate ah. workshops or That's yeah nice. so um working with different brands uh, especially when you're working with different textures and leathers yeah um are they different um to work with because i'm realizing right now that working with leather is very different from working with uh canvas excuse me i have to cough <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, <clears throat> uh, because you've got these textures, right, that you have to make sure you fill in as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, thankfully, I had a proper training from, from Louis Vuitton at that time. So, so from the training, I, I learned the characteristic of, of the fabric. So, that's mm. how I knew which kind of fabric that can be painted or the ones that cannot be painted. So, yeah, it's different. Um, for each brand and fabric. So yeah. So how, how do you make like such uh, complicated designs? We understand that you took also um, uh, orders to, yeah. to, to paint on a, you know, big bags or something yeah. like that, or a handbag that is quite big, and yeah. you want to have like full coverage yeah. uh, for your painting on it. Yeah. It has to be very detailed, <clears throat> and you have to plan it carefully, right? Yes. You can't just you know, sketch on the back. Yeah. So yeah. what is what what are the kinds of preparations? Um so usually before the painting I am going to propose the design mm -hmm. with using Photoshop. So right. so I'm going mm -hmm. to propose digitally the design to the client. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, so when after the client approved, and then I'm going to start painting. Again, with wow. that kind of project, usually it could take me like a full month. A full mm. month? Yeah, to do like wow. one bag. So that is so depends on the design. Well, you want to take your time, right? Because it's like the. Okay, if you make mistake on texture, can yeah. you Good question. take that back? Erase it? Yeah, that's an amazing question. That is actually the first question I asked to my mentor uh -huh. at Louis Vuitton. And that's the first thing I should have asked him before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, know, you know what she told me? She, <coughs> she, she looked at me straight in the eyes and she, she told me, No, Leka, we don't make mistakes. Oops. <laughs> what, that's why he's a professional. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or maybe improvise with yeah. the mistakes he made. Yeah, and I, I, I did, I did not satisfy with with her answers. So I was like, but what if? And then he just looked at me again and she said, "No, like, uh, we don't make mistakes. Oh, wow. <laughs> so you have to do it like very slowly and very carefully." Yeah. So, so tell us more. Like, what are the most challenging or memorable moments that you had? when you have, you know, collaborate with luxury brands um, and do paintings on I think uh, one of the most memorable is coming from my personal client, mm -hmm. actually. And it was my, my first Hermes Birkin. Ooh. It was Ooh. my first. And at that time, I've, I have painted like several, you know, canvas LP bags, but not as, as expensive as yeah, That's you the Birkin, know, like, so. yeah. You are painting on something that you realize what the price is like. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> My goodness. Yeah, and at that time it was it was a brand new Birkin. It was a brand new. Yeah. One. I have to call the client just to make sure does she really want to, me to are paint you it. Sure, right? And she was like, yes, like uh, oh. I bought it especially for you to paint. Oh. And, I was, and I was like, oh, <laughs> no pressure, but yeah, that was interesting. And. Wow, How did it go? Yeah. What was the design that she wanted or he wanted? Um, she wanted this. Um, it's it's quite funny. It's it's, it's a Donald Duck. Donald. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Donald Duck. That's her favorite. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Oh. yeah, and she, I mean, gladly she loves it. So. Okay, that's <laughs> Phew. great. Yeah, that's... and and you also can do the initials. That is cute, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Just personalized. That's Very that's personal. what I love. From my job, I I always ask them what is the meaning of, of their request, yeah, and and how is that you know personal and and they usually share a lot of stories. So that's interesting. Oh, that's nice. Mm, certainly cool. Yeah. How are we? Well, um, we are going to continue painting, and we're going to be right back with you with Leka Putra still in the studio and ask you more questions. So don't go anywhere. Stay tuned with us. We're our new show on today. Yes, and we're going to reveal our paint. <laughs>